that's like the original Hollywood dream. Yeah. Wow. Like coming coming straight from you know Nebraska and saying I can I was in drama school. Has that ever happened? Sure, it has. But the likelihood is is really unlikely. And the fact that if you're not connected or if you're not in with the right people or in the right circles, going in and having talent and having the right look doesn't even cut it. In in the time I've spent in LA, I've watched so many actors come and just leave defeated. You know, and a lot I've, of them turn yeah. to a lot of them turn to a darker lifestyle. Like they'll come out there trying to be because there there was an old saying that the two prettiest people in every small town come to Hollywood. Mm -hmm. Why do you think people still do that with the way the modern world is getting famous on TikTok, getting famous in your living room? I think that's a, a waning a waning thing. Right? I think it's I think it's nostalgia and, and leftover from the right. way it's always been. Probably why why would you ever move to Los Angeles yeah. to be famous? The people up here feed off of. The people that want to be famous. The predators and the prey. There's and then no, there are a few lottery winners, a yeah. few people that actually manage to win the lottery and, and make that success where there are thousands of other artists and creative types that don't, unfortunately. And now so. you're living with a Hollywood that only will, they're not taking risks on independent films it's all marvel or star yeah. wars it's 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 proven franchises but once an independent film breaks out and becomes a success then the predators come and they, and down they, on it and they uh, fucking rape it <laughs> and and they absolutely bend it over a stump and rape it for yeah, everything every it. penny that it's tarantino worth. is the perfect example yeah well the one thing about hollywood now is the unfair advantage of on some levels is going away because you don't like you said you don't have to move from Wyoming to Hollywood no more. You you literally can start a channel with your phone. You have more technology in a phone than they had in 1980. Absolutely, you know, or or when they were making movies at some point, 25, 30 years ago, Hollywood was tight. Like it was it was gate kept like you wouldn't believe. Well, here's the sad thing for people that get like a, a quick little viral hits that are like oh. A, a million people saw you last night. Let's get you a manager. Let's get you this. Let's get you this. Yeah. The Hawk to a girl. Same. That's that's the perfect uh, fucking example right now. Yeah. No, here's exactly what's happening in real time. All these people surrounded her because they know she doesn't understand the situation. So they know they got a six month window of cashing in on her. But they're telling her, you got to do this appearance because it'll get you in front of Fox Studios, you got to do this appearance. And the whole time they're taking all the money. Yeah. And then six months from now when she's, you know, people are people are over the whole like meme of what she's done. She's not booking. She's not booking. They'll, well, it just didn't work out. But they, they drop her. They cashed in for a few million over that course. What we're going through right now, she's probably going to events just to be, you know, seen and getting paid. And yep. she might get a couple, like a day rate, but the, they're, Agents are convincing her, like, we can make you a star, merch lines, we could do all this stuff. And they're taking all the money and convincing her of this long term play when, in fact, it's very, it's already done, in my opinion. So if oh, she, no. if yeah. she's smart, then she's tucking, if she's not she's making smart, money. She's, she's not making money. She's not making, think the, about this. The people in charge of her are making the money because okay. they're selling her on a future that there's, they know is not even going to be possible, but they're short playing her to take all the money up front that, while she's sort of a hot commodity. Because she doesn't know. So yeah. she says, oh, I get $30,000 for an appearance. No, 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 The management company gets $30,000. That 30 grand's the budget. That's the travel, that's the hotel, that's everything. Mm. And the, and Here's the, two grand. And the managers and are getting their makeup people jobs, their hair people jobs are like, hey, we got one on the line, come over and do her hair for 10 grand or five grand or whatever. And they're convincing her of this long-term play when they know good and well. They know this is a three-month play. Oh, yeah, they, they will know. cash in. But the management company knows there's a new hawk to a girl coming in three months. The sad reality, a lot of those girls in Hollywood, and yeah. you know, I'm not saying this is going to happen for her, but they're going to take her from here, promise her this. When she lands down here, they'll start selling her to, like, well, do you want to do porn? We can mm. get you 100 grand for a porn. Do you mm. want to do a strip club circuit? You could be the hot. I mean, that'd be like ten grand a night. It was like taking a sponge and just wringing yeah, all like, of the water out of it that you possibly her, can. Her ceiling as a star, 
anybody with common sense knows that it's it's not going to happen. She wasn't even an actress. She was just on a street in New Orleans. Nashville, yeah. But her uh, exposure is so high, they're not going to get her in the new Marvel movie, but they could get her in the new Skinamax film, you know, if she gets naked for it. That's Yeah, well, that's so, why I say if, if, if she gets a reality show and if it is actually good and funny, then, you know, she's got a future. Well, here's what Haley should do. It's her name, right? Haley? If Haley wants to really, really, really take advantage of the Hawk to a moment, yeah. she should fire everybody that's working around her, get an apartment, start an OnlyFans. Oh. Boom. She, she, she could no, make- No, she's she, already said she's not going to do that. And what could she do to get you past this. that? How great would it be if the Hawk to a girl was a fucking rocket scientist? And she just <laughs> happened to be drunk that night. And she said that. So that she just happened great. to give a slip inside her personal life that she spits on dicks. <laughs> but behind the scenes, she was curing cancer. That would be, holy shit, yeah, elevator. Bring a cause to curing cancer. Bring a cause to curing diseases. But no. Let me ask you the most simple, basic question. Why did she go viral? Why? And, you, and you're, you're a dude, you're a dude. Why did she go viral? She came in talking about filthy sex, you know, yep. being being kind of the porno chick. And if she wants, here's the thing: if she wants to pursue a dream, God bless her. I don't have any issue with people right. pursuing a dream. Dude, I'm with you. But nothing she's going to do, or uh, she's not going to impress anybody enough in any field to get past how hard she's been branded as the hot tua girl. Sure. So the only parallel to that that she could succeed in is porn. I, I no, guess what dude, I'm I, I guess what I'm asking though is why was it so why did it capture the attention of so many people? To me, I understand it. It we're was all perverts. Nah, I mean she here's the thing. That's why it sells because she was the most unassuming girl that would say yeah. something like that. And she was pretty enough and she was she was kinda like charming enough and you're like confident enough and you're like, I'm into it. But at the root of it, she got pop she got famous for exploiting Porn, spitting on dicks. Oh, so geez. here's the thing: fuck all the talk to a hot sauce. Fuck the t-shirts. Fuck the hot to a. Oh, is there a hot sauce? Yeah, they, they they're trying to market. Throw all that out the window. Get an old fans. Do I need someone to to take the hot sauce and spit it? I'm my... see, see, I'm, I'm <laughs> sitting here thinking it was an Olympic event where you but already... you, and you see how far you can spit it, <laughs> and you it guys are be. talking sex. It could be, but the thing is, is that's what she's famous for. Is the end of the day is sex. You know, it's like that's yeah, what she's right. famous for, and so why not cash out on that? She's not going to be. No, a, that's true. She's not going to be listen, a big actress. She's not. Yeah. She doesn't have. She's... Think about this. We're all as human beings given about 80 years of life what do you do with those 80 years i mean obviously numbers it's hard for any of us to predict uh what we will experience in those 80 years but if an opportunity comes on along uh i think a, a smart person needs to take uh, within reason, that opportunity and roll with it because it right. may be the only fucking opportunity you get in your eighty years. She's known for the next sixty years. Let me ask as you, a but if she girl. makes two million dollars and invests that, she could save a apartment that's on fire. She could save a hundred lives tomorrow. It would say. Girl known as Hawk to a girl saves life. That would be the first thing. <laughs> right. That's if true. She goes, if, she meets, if, she, if she meets a guy and then Thank you, if Ray. she meets the guy and, that is they, true. and the guy takes her to her parents, they're going to go, oh, you're the Hawk to a girl. Yeah. The reality for her is if she, was in, if she won an Academy Award tomorrow, they would say Hawk to a girl won Academy Award. Right. Well, see, that's what I've been curious about. How quickly, how quickly is it going to go away? Right. Uh, here's I don't the thing. Know. It's going to go uh, away no matter what in our in our. In, in our face, but it's never going to go away for a long time as a, a viral moment. Right. Like you can talk, back it up, Terry, where the guy was at the fireworks every 4th of July that yeah. comes up. That'll yeah. never die. Hawk Tool will never die. It'll, will it be in our faces? No, but she could, she could be the Hawk Tool girl and make appearances at bars, contests, magazines, yeah, but talk who's going to want to see her in 10 years doing that? That's, and how yeah. sad of a life for her. Cash in. Move somewhere, change your hair color, change your name, and start a new life with your money. She's already posted a couple of things going, uh, talking about how people have called out her 15 minutes of fame. She knows internally this is on life support. 